Hello guys, it's Striker. Welcome back to another video. So today we're going to be talking about uh, Atletico Madrid versus Juventus in the Champions League. Round of 16 first leg, man. The game played um, at the uh, uh, Wanda Metro Stadium, I believe. Uh, the, it played in, in Madrid. Um, Atletico also in uh, Juventus, man. Game ended in a 2-0 win. Very surprised by this scoreline, really, man. I thought it was going to be a close game. I thought it would have been a draw. or uh, I thought it would be a, a, like a, a win for Juventus, but it'd be a close win for Juventus or at least a draw. But the game ended in a um, a 2 0 win for uh, Atletico Madrid, man. Uh, great, um, def great, great um, win for them in general. Uh, two of their defenders scoring um, the goal, two of the uh, Uruguayan defenders scoring the goals. One in the 78th minute and one in the 83rd minute. So they pretty much scored two goals in five minutes. And um, Juventus, I don't know what happened. Juventus pretty much, they just like collapsed. It collapsed towards the end of the game. And uh, the only play that I think really played very well for them was Ronaldo. Ronaldo was very involved um, going forward, good driven skills, taking shots. I think the one of my problem with Ronaldo tonight was that he was taking a lot of shots from a distance instead of trying to get inside the box. He got inside the box like one or two times. Um, he had a great free kick in the in the first half when Gordon took him down. And uh, no, I think no, Gordon didn't take him down. Like one of um, Atletico players took him down. And uh, while he was down, Gordon pretty much kicked the ball at him. And I thought it was disrespectful. But um, he took the he took the free kick. Uh, took a great shot at goal. Um, Hablak came up big with that save. It was a great save by Hablak. Great free kick by Ronaldo. Any other goalkeeper probably would have scored that goal. It probably would have been a different. Um, Different result at the end of the game, man. But uh, game went back and forth. I think both teams was um, equal. Um, but Juventus dominated the game, though. They dominated the game, especially in the first half. Um, going forward more. Good passes. Good link-up play. Uh, man, Zukic, I think he had a mixed game. Because, like, the two goals that were scored came off him. Pretty much came off his foot. He was trying to um, trying to block the ball from going towards goal. And end up... Uh, the first one ending up at uh, Jose uh, Jimenez uh, leg, and he were able to kick it, uh, kick it towards goal after a scramble inside the box. After uh, I believe it was a corner kick inside the box, a scramble inside the box, and he were able to get it after Mizuki tried to clear the ball. Ball end up at uh, Jimenez foot, and he were able to score the first goal. Good goal by him. The second goal again in the eighth third minute. Um, I believe it's a corner kick. A, no, I believe it's a free kick or, or a cross inside the box, and. Um, and yes, yeah, it's a free kick inside the box. And um, Mizukic man was the last man towards goal. Try to clear the ball, <laughs> and it end up at Diego Golden leg. And uh, Golden were able to um, score the goal, man, from a tight angle. Ronaldo was in front of him too, man, but Ronaldo didn't block it, and it went in. And that was a good goal by Golden. Golden had a phenomenal game. Um, very good defensively. Work rate was crazy. Um, same with Jimenez, man. Jimenez definitely man after match. He was superb all around. Um, good result. Morata did score, though. Morata scored in the 70-plus minute. Scored the first goal of the game, man. But uh, they went to VAR. VAR uh, pretty much ruled it offside. So, um, great. Uh, not good for Morata, man. I go with the serve Morata a, a lot. Um, Diego Costa up top, man. He, he, he didn't have the best of game, but he, he, he was working. He was working. He kind of dived. Um, in the first half, almost got a penalty out of the diving. Um, Cellini pretty much um, was running behind him and he just fell over, tripped, and um, he pretty much wanted to dive to get a penalty. But referee um, gave them the uh, the gave them the free kick on top of the eighteen. Uh, Griezmann took a great uh, free kick uh, and almost scored it, man. But Chesney came up big and saved it. Chesney mixed results again. I think he was superb throughout the game, and but those two. Uh, goals kind of um, hurt his um, overall rating in the hand. Um, yeah, like no, there was no really standout play for me for uh, for uh, Juventus man. I think they they pretty much underperformed uh, in my book. But uh, Bentacor he was awful, probably one of the worst play out there. The players that came on like Emery Chan, uh, Bernadeschi, and um, Cancelo didn't really do too much. Uh, their defense was poor. Um, Cellini was the only one I think did very well in defense, man. Uh, uh, Bonici was very poor, man. Um, pretty much was struggling to keep up with uh, Griezmann. Uh, I think uh, Atletico Madrid did a very good job locking Ronaldo down. It was like one or two men on Ronaldo all the time, always following him. 
and a uh, good result, man. Koke, very good game. Partey, I think I, I think Partey is a very good player. I think he's very underrated. I uh, did not have the best game. I probably him and Costa probably was the worst play out here today. Griezmann looking very good throughout the game. Uh, was a threat throughout, man. And Diego Costa at times was trying to he was getting by um, Juventus defense, man. Chilini was the only one that really tried to keep up with him. But on the two occasions he get by their defense and almost had um, score with a one on one. Um, situation with uh chesney uh but good result for atletico madrid overall man and uh ronaldo returning back to um spain uh madrid is not good it was, didn't hand in a good result um and zulkish pretty much two deflection led to the goal he returned to his old team atletico madrid and it wasn't a good result for him man. but uh surprise win for Atletico. not really yeah in my opinion it's a surprise win for atletico madrid and uh they got to go back to uh turin uh italy to defend their two leads uh two zero lead and i think they'd be able to pull this one off man i think i'll let the commentary be able to go back to uh in the next round go to um italy and uh hold off for a draw or at least win that game because this was a great result for them but like subscribe man this is my new channel by the way um hopefully you guys enjoy my video enjoy my thoughts on the game like subscribe for more of these video and let me know you think about my reaction and the game in general and with that you boys out of here